Welcome back, everybody, to uh, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. I'm an old guy gaming, and we're picking up right where we left off from the last episode. So, it's time for us to go to... I guess we're going to go to Kashyyyk, but we had another planet that we were able to travel to as well. So, let's go talk to um, our captain, whose name I can always forget. It starts with a G. Yeah, you and me. Grease. We're yeah. unstoppable together. <laughs> Don't you think, kid, huh? The man is in greeds, every time perfect landing. You could say that. Ever piloted a ship before? No, mostly just scrapper transports and Braca. Oh, kid, you gotta get in the cockpit sometime. Feel the controls in your hands and the galaxy in your grasp. Oh, it's unbelievable. Sounds good. Let me know when. Huh? No, not mine. <laughs> Not the man is, no way. I'm just saying you should try it sometime. But with someone else's shit. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay. Uh, so we got BD over here. Um, yeah, let's talk to him. What's up, Grease? Remember that scout walker you took down? The ATST? Yeah. You got up close and personal, right? What are you getting at, Grease? How's about you liberate one of those things from the Empire and I take it for a spin? Oh, you gonna help me out next time we're in a fight? What? No, no way. It's always fighting with you. Yeah, forget I said anything. <laughs> Storm worrying you? Nah, there's a lot of things that bother me. The Empire, deadly creatures, poorly cooked burrow fish. But when I'm in my ship, it's all breezy greasy. Good to know. We've got a lot more flying ahead of us. Right. No need to keep reminding me, though. Greasy breezy. This is the greatest machine ever built. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, that's all he's got to say. Um, does Seer have anything more? Nope, she's done talking to us for now. She's contemplating. All right, I don't think there's anything else for us to do, guys. We are ready to rock and roll. -a. Doesn't look like he fixed his landing gear, though. Okay, let's do this. Where to next, Cal? All right, so locate Tarful on Kashyyyk. Okay, how do I? I'm still haven't figured out how we change to another planet. So space escape, move. So we're on Zepho. This is Kashyyyk. We were on Pagano earlier, and then we also have this Dathomir planet, which we could go to if we hit R. But I, no, you know what? Let's just keep following the main story for now. So let's go ahead and head to Kashyyyk. All right, here we go. Well, oh, I guess I have to hold that down. Grease, have you ever thought of redecorating? The Mantis? Why would I? Eh, wouldn't hurt to throw some art on the walls. Something new to look at. Since when do you care about art? I've always liked it. When I was younger, I used to pour through every piece I could find at the Jedi Archives. Did you critique them too? I admired them. When I became a seeker, I got to see a few in person. So many different cultures in the galaxy, and each one had their own unique works of art. It was breathtaking. Hmm. Sometimes I can sit in the seat, but it's not letting me do it now. Oh, here we go. Sit in your cockpit chair for landing. Oh, this isn't good. Oh, tell me we're not running that blockade. Oh, only as a last resort. I break the Mantis's transponder to transmit Imperial signals. Hey, Grease. Yeah. Keep your power signature low and act like we belong. Just like Bracca. No sweat. I don't need another set of hands. Just please keep your eye on the scanner. All please. right. All right, all right. He's a little grumpy, but I like the guy. Zoinks! I don't see anything. You're preoccupied with something on the ground. We're clear. That 
doesn't look good. What doesn't the look good? The Empire is devouring Kashyyyk for its natural resources. Mookies have been enslaved. Or displaced. Oh! That was a close one, kid! Aren't you supposed to be watching the monitors? Guerrilla fighters. Wookiees and off-worlders embushing an Imperial convoy. Walkers approaching their position. Tarful could be with them. Tarful could be anywhere. Like, deep in the ground, like we're gonna be if we get caught up in that battle down there. We don't have any other options. <laughs> and... And they'll die without our help. So what's your plan? Sabotage. We used to scrap walkers on Braca. I'll just jack one. <laughs> get a load of the kid. He thinks we're back in a Clone Wars. Captain. <laughs> Get us near those walkers. Wait, what? Listen, <laughs> those walkers double as troop transport, so once you get inside, be careful. I have no freeze grease to work as magic. No freeze hey, grease? Do me a favor. Stay alive down there. I'll add it to the plan. Right, if you're jumping, you better do it now, kid. Oh boy, here we go. This is gonna you be ready crazy. For a swim, BD? Wow. You ready to do this? Oh! That was close. Bam! This is a big walker here. I like that little one we just took on. Okay, so we're gonna climb up the vines on this thing. Now how do we get on top? Um Okay. Oh shit. I have to come at it from this way and then. There we go. Okay. Okay. Now where? Oh. Um. That's a long ways over. Oh shit. Okay. Whew. I wasn't sure we're gonna make that. Let's finish this. We're climbing around his beard. Thanks, BD. Climb to the top. Somebody's shooting at us. Go that way. Um, do we? Okay, I'm a little confused. Okay, so what do we get? What do we do here? What do we do? Do we get back up on the ladder?
Hmm. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, get out of here. Really? Oh, I was gonna say, <laughs> we're gonna ride a, a speeder bike? gonna have some more too. Look at BB. It actually worked. Yeah, right. Okay, uh, throttle. Report, what's happening over there? You're in violation of Imperial Protocol. Can you shut that guy up? Stand down or we won't have... Better. <laughs> Let's do this. That's a blaster. Oh, yeah, baby. That was awesome. Okay. So, how do we know uh, what the health of this thing is? Because they said the hull was at 72% or something like that. I don't see anything. Maybe we don't worry about it at this point. Okay, the guys in the orange must be friendlies. Hey! Who are you? Someone who just brought an ad to the table. Who are you? Ad -ad. Someone making the Empire angry. <laughs> We're advancing on an imp landing pad up ahead. I wouldn't mind fire support. Copy that. Let's make him even angrier. He's angry. Oh man, I love these blasters. This is fun, you guys. Not gonna lie, this is fun. It's clear, map. Let's blow up those TIE fighters. Supposed to be blowing that thing up? It's headed for us. Can you do anything? Oh shit! Hold on! 
That was fun, man. That was a wild ride. This game is fun, you guys. If you guys don't have this game, you've got to you got to get this game. <laughs> it's fun. I've really enjoyed it. Oh man, look at that. The at at. Yeah, I'm okay. Got splat splat. Right? <laughs> no, we are not doing that again. <laughs> you just wrecked a perfectly good walker. Got a name? Cal Kestis. Sogarera. What are you doing on Kashyyyk? Looking for somebody. What are you doing here? My companions and I came to Kashyyyk to disrupt Imperial supply lines. Hey! So, who are you looking for? A Wookiee chieftain named Tarful. Tarful is impossible to find. There's a reason he's evaded the Empire for this long. He's a freedom fighter? He's THE freedom fighter. A symbol of the Wookiee resistance. Striking at the Empire from the Shadowlands. Huh. See ya? Shadowlands? Breeze, this is Saul. How you doing? What do you want with Toph? Jedi business. Jedi are dead. Not all of them. <clears throat> you get that over corpse? My master gave it to me. This pad supports an Imperial refinery that runs on Wookiee slave labor. Intel suggests that some of the captives there are guerrilla fighters. I should help them. One of them might know how to contact Tarful. It's possible. Whoa, wait a minute, hold on, wait a minute. The Manus works wonders. I mean, it's a great ship, excellent pilot, but <laughs> it is not built for close support. We'll stay here and monitor Imperial transmissions. With a bit of luck, we'll intercept any distress calls. Appreciate it. My lieutenants and I will scout ahead to prepare the attack. Join us when you're ready. Go, go. Multiple entries. Okay, a fateful meeting. While descending into Kashyyyk's atmosphere, the Mantis crew became embroiled in a skirmish between Imperial forces and Freedom fighters. Believing Wiki Chief and Tarful could be among them, Cal jumped ship and hijacked an at-at, piloting it right into the infamous insurgent Saw General. Uh, S S oh no, Saw Guerrero, sorry. Uh, Saw and his fighters were in the middle of a, of a campaign to liberate a nearby R Rocher Sap refinery with the possibility that Tarful could be one of the Wikis detained there. Cal and BD1 agreed to help them. All right. Uh, it said there was multiple entries. What else? What else do we have? Oh, probably uh, Saw. <clears throat> okay, infamous Onderonian insurgent Saw Guerrero leads a group of opposition fighters against the Empire on the Wookiee homeworld of Kashyyyk. Harboring dark vengeance over the death of his sister during the Clone Wars, he lives by a blurred moral line, considering collateral damage to be a necessary evil. He comes to respect Cal as a strong potential ally and useful tool in his endless war. All right. Okay, and then uh, is there something else? There's probably another entry for, for Seer, I'll bet. BD-1 has an entry? Now, we already knew all that stuff. I probably just didn't read it. What about greets? Nope. Seer. Well, no, we read. We already read that. Okay, Cal. Yeah, we read that too. Okay, I think that's it. Wait a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Cordova's journey. There's something new here. No, I think I think we've already read all that stuff. We just didn't actually look at it in here. Okay, let's talk to Grease. Glad you're all right. Yeah, yeah, good to see you too. This place is a dump. Your plan worked. And now you want to follow Saul? <clears throat> uh you don't? Whoops. You don't like that idea? I'm concerned you're jumping from one risk to the next. Wait, what? I fly my ship in the middle of a battlefield, and now we're talking about risks? <laughs> Why didn't you stop me? My job is to guide you on your path, not choose it for you. So here's my advice. The Empire's overtaken hundreds of worlds. There's a reason Saw chose Kashyyyk. 
Saul's goals may not be the same as ours. We should be careful. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind. Hmm, that adds, adds some complication, doesn't it? Okay, let's talk to Seer. Be there, you heard the Parsons? Rumors and cantinas, but not much to go on. They call them radicals. I heard the Empire's got bounties on their heads. Bounties? Should I be worried about the bounties? Huh, I doubt it. War zones are bad for business. If the rumors are even true. Okay, you have more to say? Do you think the Inquisitors will find us here? It's possible. You better hope not. We barely made it here. Well, we couldn't leave the Parsons and Wookiees to die. Cal, your instincts are good, but that's not within your control. We can do our part. That's it. Be careful. Hurry up. This place gives me the creeps. Okay, I guess that's all they have to say. All right, so, um, what are we supposed to do? <laughs> oh, we're supposed to go rescue wiki prisoners. That's what we're supposed to do. Okay, so we got to go that direction. Okay, let's do it. Gonk droid. EG6 power droids, also known as gonk droids, serve as, serve as portable power generators in mobile operations or in situations lacking a stable power source. They are utilized by civilians and military alike, often emitting a low honking noise that sounds like the word gonk. Hmm. I didn't even know that's what those things were called. It's like a walking battery. We probably can't get over here, can we? Things are Invisible even worse walls. here than on Zepho. Did you say Zepho? I used to live there before the Empire came. Do you know it? Yeah, I've been. It's horrible what happened. We weren't able to fight back. But here, with the Wookiees, we have a chance. Thank you for standing with us. Interact. Uh, Marina. A uh, brave fighter, Marina Surf saw Guerrero's forces on the besieged world of Kashyyyk. After losing her husband on Zepho, her, her journey takes her across the galaxy in her battle against Empire. Empire. Interact. Force showed me something on Zepho. Memories of someone named Ostar. My partner. He distracted the stormtroopers so I could escape with our daughter. He was always impulsive. Is I remember he... that. Yeah. I found his body. Part of me wanted to believe he escaped. I'm so sorry. No. Don't be. I'm glad I know the truth. We can't allow the Empire to destroy more worlds. All right. Yeah, I, rem I actually remember coming across that uh, that sense uh, echo. Interesting. Okay. Anything else? If anything goes wrong with this plan, we're finished. Mari's mapped out the nearest garrisons. The Empire won't have time to send reinforcements. We'll be okay. If we can do it quick. Saw's seen us through worse. I've got nothing but respect for that man, but this isn't a forest skirmish. I hope we're ready. Hmm. Okay. Anything else? I don't think there's anything else we can do. These guys don't have anything to say, do they? Other than... Okay, I'll stop. That's what they were saying, though. What about you guys? Over here. Could be supplies inside this walker. You okay? I'm I'm fine. Phew. I'm fine. Maybe a little bruised, but it's not so bad. Okay, so he's okay. Don't scare me like that. I need you around. <laughs> Let's keep looking. There must be something useful in this heap. Okay. I think that's all we can do. Let's go. Moving out. Moving out. Excuse me, Mr. Gonk Droid. My camera just all of a sudden changed on me. Uh, what you got, Petey? 
Weapon Cache. These specialized Imperial flamethrowers have been modified to more effectively incinerate Kashyyyk's wildlife. Well, that's not good. Flamethrowers! Oh, great. We're gonna have to deal with flamethrowers now. I wonder if we can force push the flame back onto him. Something tells me walking through that red stuff's probably not healthy. It doesn't hurt us, we just can't get through it. So, we gotta figure this one out. Uh, and we can't do anything with this? Break the conduit? Nope. Hmm. Alright, let's go back up into here. We came through that door. That doesn't allow us to switch anything. Here we go. Oh. What in the hell is that? Forest trench. Saw should be at the other end of this trench. Whatever that thing of doodle was, it ran in here. Check out the bench over there. Could be something useful. Hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. That's where we were before. Something tells me we're gonna have to find something in here. Like a spider, maybe? Oh shit! Oh, ow! Ow! Oh shit! Okay. What's that? It's a big spider, that's what it is. A uh, Y shock. Attack from behind while the creature is distracted by other prey. Parry its lunge attack to quickly strike it down. Y shocks are highly intelligent, multi leg predators. They are found to be extremely aggressive to most sentient life forms and known. To cast an adhesive enzyme that incapacitates their prey in a web-like stasis, allowing them to strike with the sharp and venomous fangs. Why is they outsmarting any foe? They often lower quickly from forest canopies or burrow to the surface from underground cover. If possible, prey should avoid any web strike, but if caught, fight to escape before the Y shark closes in. Their hostility may provide strategic opportunities for a surprise attack from behind. Although capable of quick maneuvering, they occasionally find themselves susceptible to strikes in the head or appendages. All right. Lovely. Okay, let's see. What do we got here? How much current can you conduct? Well, with this transformer, I bet you can short circuit Imperial Tech. Nice. So does that give us that, um... Overcharge. BD-1 can now turn machinery on and off. Doing okay back there, BD-1? Nice. Okay. When BD-1 is near overcharge panels, 
to turn certain machines on and off. Oh, press R when he's near when we're near overcharge panels. Okay, gotcha. I don't think there's anything else we can need to do with our lightsaber because we've already got it customized. I don't remember getting anything new since the last time we did it, so. Okay. Hey, Skizzers, what's going on, dude? Sorry, I didn't see you there. How you doing, man? Thanks for showing up. Ah, uh, all right. Um, let's see. So I guess we need to go... Can we climb this vine thing here? No, nope, we gotta we have to climb up here, I think. Here? Alright. What the hell? Ah, okay. We got a, a zip. I think what we have to do is cut this. No. Hmm, how do we get over there? Oh, duh. There's a climbing wall right here. Let's try it. Are we, like, supposed to... Oh, okay. Never mind. I see what we're doing. Okay, but wait a minute. How do we get over there? Maybe we don't get over there right now. Maybe that's something happens later. Because <laughs> we can't go up the zip line. We can only go down it. Because, you know, zip line. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure how we get over there. Unless, like I said, there's another route to get over there later, but I, w I don't know what that route would be. Maybe we need to use the force. No, oh, that didn't do anything. We should be able to climb up this, li this little conduit here, man. What the hell? Customized lightsaber. No, we don't need to customize lightsaber. Well, maybe, maybe there will be a way for us to get on top of that and then walk over there and drop down later. That's my guess, because I don't see any other way up there. I don't see any other way up there. There's a switch up there. Okay, well, let's just keep going because I'm, I'm not sure what else to do. This is the way we came in, right? Okay, maybe there's another route. Is this something over here? Not that I can see. needs power. No, 
we got to stop it a little sooner because it takes it has a little bit of momentum so I'm thinking right here that should work okay but hmm anybody have any suggestions about how we would get back up there because I'm starting to think that there isn't going to be another route later on down the road If he just does this, it just moves that back that way. I don't think it's going to let us use that. Yeah, see, it doesn't let us latch onto that because it's going up. Huh. Okay, okay. Don't tell me anymore, but thank you for telling me that because at least I'm not wasting time. Thanks, buddy. Okay. So, Skizzer says to keep going, so let's just keep going. Got some uh, firefly looking thing medoodles over there. Oh! Oops! That hurt. Help me, BD1. Hmm. I'm Flame beetle. Airborne pest with flammable posterior will spontaneously combust in close proximity or upon death. The pesky flame beetle is, fly, uh, is a flying insectoid known for its bioluminescent combustible posterior. Uh, in other words, its ass blows up. These creatures synthesize chemicals derived from local flora into a highly flammable derivative. Extreme caution should be exercised when in close proximity. Uh, you yeah, think? Okay. Sap refinery lies dead ahead. What does the Empire want with tree sap? Nothing good. They refine the sap into a powerful compound, and they're rushing to expand production. We have to stop them. That's the plan. We don't know they're in game, but they spread themselves too thin. This map we've uncovered proves it. Here you go, bud. These refineries double as brutal prison camps. They use those cutters to create a distraction while you take your lightsaber and free the Wookiees inside. We need their help to stop the Empire. Understood. Watch yourself in there. You hear that? Said he needs my help. Come on, buddy. New objective added to Hollow Map. Okay. Free the Wookiees. So we're going to have to go through there. And he said we needed to start those uh, saw thingamadoodles to distract the Empire. Okay. Do we have a save point anywhere near? 
Looks like there's something down here. Sense echo. Dead trooper. I saw I got him. He's more ruthless than I realized. Saw's ambush. This trooper was ruthlessly killed by Saw Guerrera. Remind me not to get on his bad side. Okay. Anything else over here? That saw and his people mixing it up over there. I need to find a save point. Oh shit, there's more of those blow up bugs. Imperial refinery. Oh, right here. Okay. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. We're going to wrap this one up, and then, uh, as usual, we'll start uh, pick up right where we left off in the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you did, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and share out the video, and we'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.